In this video, we are going to talk about bilirubin crystals in urine sample. So, uh, bilirubin crystals basically form in acidic urine. And uh, the other indication for bilirubin crystals is bilirubin urea. That is, the body is having either like increased excretion of bilirubin in the urine. So, increased bilirubin will start to precipitate and form crystals. You should remember about bilirubin that it is a very photosensitive, uh, uh, it is very photosensitive in nature. So it, if the sample of urine you are having, like you ha have taken the urine sample in your at your home from your animal and you are sending it to the lab, make sure the sample is protected from the light because the bilirubin in in that sample if it is exposed to light it will break down so you are going to have a false positive or false negative results um bilirubin is bright orange to yellow in color as you can see its picture they are present as needle like bundles and aggregates so you can see this uh, image or you can see over here too uh, these are present as needle like aggregates or bundles Bilirubin crystals from, from conjugated bilirubin uh, water soluble, so uh, you should remember this too. Uh, they tend to precipitate onto other formed elements in urine. What does this mean? Basically, uh, you know, if uh, like there are two ways, either bilirubin, uh, uh, there is high concentration of bilirubin, so it will precipitate and uh, accumulate onto itself and form a crystal like uh, this. But there is also a situation that if there is high bilirubin in the urine and there is some cell present like you know in the urine samples you either have squamous cell transitional epithelial cells these cells come from the urinary tract so what will happen bilirubin will start to uh, precipitate onto these formed elements and uh, formed elements and uh, form a crystal so it can either precipitate onto other formed elements like for example cells or uh, some other things or it will precipitate onto its own self like they will just clump together uh, as far as uh, dogs are concerned it is most common in canine urine especially in highly concentrated urine samples so it's of no clinical significance uh, as far as dogs are concerned so it does not indicate any pathologic disease uh, happening or underlying the body uh, it is less commonly present in the urine of other species so if in these other species, you are having bilirubin crystals under microscope or having a positive chemical reaction on urine dipstick for bilirubin, then it is an abnormal finding and you must be like, oh, there is something and you should then investigate for an underlying cholestatic process or like other liver function uh, tests, etc. So you should remember in these species, it is not common, but it is in urine of the dog, it is very common. So in canines, it is of no clinical significance, but in feline, equine, bovine, camelid urine, it is an abnormal finding. Um, that was all about uh, bilirubin crystals. Thank you so much.